This, if you're a fan like me, you'll agree that Drop the Dead Donkey is among the best sitcoms ever. So do you want to join me today? Grab a chair, sit by the campfire, and we'll live this great show together. We'll travel through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who have left us and celebrating those who still shine. Are you ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Stephen Tompkinson played the character Damien Day in the sitcom when he was 25 in 1990. See, at 58 years old, he's living a fulfilling life for the passion right here in Durham, England. Just before it went down, did you by any chance happen to put in a floppy? <laughs> Half five on a Sunday morning at the end of May. Beautiful day. Mm. And these two chaps turned up, one just dressed in his underpants. Hayden Wynn played the character Alex Bates in the sitcom when she was 33 years old in 1990. Sadly, on October 20th, 2023, she left us due to cancer at 66 in London, England. We are deeply saddened by her passing. You're minuscule for energy. <laughs> you move downwards or sideways. Or did he get lost down the back of the sofa? <laughs> Why didn't Edwina Curry get back in then? I mean, God knows. She yeah, it's, I'm absolutely chuffed and very <laughs> grateful to the people who voted. Um, I don't know what Margaret Thatcher would make of me or my performers, but she'd, she'd definitely approve of... Um... Neil Pearson played character Dave Charnley in the sitcom when he was 31 in 1990. C, at 64 years old, he's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in London, England. Interesting, isn't it? Can something that's cold and robotic have a sense of humour? What the hell is going on? No, probably not. <laughs> I have just punched up the... ...on that sort of movie while you're making it, then it is um, you know, yeah. transfused through well, the film. And I think as well the authenticity, whether it's Shadwell, whether it's um, Bridget Joe. David Troughton played the character Roy Merchant in the sitcom when he was 48 in 1998. See, at 73 years old, he is living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in London, England. Roy Merchant Jr. has arrived with the new business plan. A thousand welcomes, and any graffiti you may see is the work of fifth columnists from rival companies. Lives in a village called Little Weirwold. He's about 67, 68. He's a widower, has been for 41 years. Um... Jeff Raw played the character George Stand in the sitcom when he was 39 in 1990. See, at the age of 72, he's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Warwickshire, England. What do you mean, firecrackers? Well, you know, to get them up. And... No, 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 no. <laughs> now, why do we cut this interview with Gummus? I worked with on uh, Doctor Who. Um, well, actually, I didn't work with her on Doctor Who. That's, that's a lie, and Doctor Who fans will know that's not true, because uh, I worked with Peter Davidson on Doctor Who. Uh, Susanna Doyle played the character Joy Merriweather in the sitcom when she was 25 in 1991. See, at 57 years old, she's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Surrey, England. Boy, you're light. So? Person under a train at Leicester Square. Selfish git. Why couldn't he just stick his head in the oven like any normal <laughs> And uh, then having a juxtaposition of two different ways of dealing with life, um, both very beautiful women, but they are at a certain age and a certain time. Hermione Norris played the character art critic in the sitcom when she was 48 in 1998. See, at 73 years old, she is living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Stockholm, Sweden. She happens to be the daughter of our much loved proprietor, Sir Royston. Please. I just want to be treated like any other trainee. I'm quite happy to make Josh, the little boy, who was the little boy, is on his gap year. So her main focus has been work and raising her family, and then obviously still inescapably. Victoria Wicks played the character Sally Smedley in the sitcom when he was 31 in 1990. See, at 64 years old, she is living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Wiltshire, England, UK. Sally. I'm an old age pensioner from Gloucester, and whenever you come on, the news just doesn't seem so bad. Yours, Tom Patterson, F. Block, Broadmoor. <laughs> Healthy behaviors and lifestyles, are they getting an adequate time for uh, exercise and, and 
just play. I mean, there's there's so many unmet needs uh, in that respect. Melvin Hayes played the character Sir Gordon in the sitcom when he was 63 in 1998. See, at the age of 89, he's living a fulfilling life with passion right here in London, England. Oh yes, Henry Kissinger. What an amazing man. Managed to keep the war in Cambodia a secret from the press and the government. And fancy doing all that and still having time for a number one hit. Bend. He said, and when I say action and come towards the camera, he said, I'll wave my left arm if you're too near the edge. <gasps> <laughs> and I'll wave my... Robert Duncan played the character Gus Hatches in the sitcom when he was 38 in 1990. See, at 71 years old, he is living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in St. Austell, UK. I'm sorry if life's been stress heavy since Alex crept off to the enemy trenches. Gus, all Alex did was accept a better job elsewhere, okay? There's no need to be so... The theater is very temporary. You know, you do a performance and it's over and it's, it's just in your memory and the audience's memory, um, and then with filmed... Ingrid Lacey played the character Helen Cooper in the sitcom when she was 35 in 1993. See, at 65 years old, she's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in Godalming, UK. In our female audience, what sort of items would you include to win back the little ladies? Well, obviously more items on fashion. Good student to tell me how famous she was because to right. me she was mama yeah. my parents never talked about their career their image they just did what it was interesting david swift played the character henry davenport in the sitcom when he was 59 in 1990 sadly on april 8 2016 he left us due to complications from alzheimer's disease at the age of 85 in london england we are deeply saddened by his passing well but you haven't heard the last of this quite Expect a call from my agent. Can't we just pay? Took the freights out to California and submitted my drawings, my meager little drawings to the Disney studio, which was then over in Silver Lake. And I was... Jeffrey McGivern played the character repeat introductions in the sitcom when he was 38 in 1990. See, at 72 years old, he's living a fulfilling life with a passion right here in London, UK. Inspector? Yeah. It is possible. <laughs> Fine. If you just sign this, Mr. Dent, that'll be all. Thank you. So. Okay, let's chat. Who is your favorite character in Drop the Dead Donkey? Please comment and share interesting things below this video. And as always, show some love. Hit the like button, subscribe to know more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content. I can't wait to create more wonderful memories with you. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more. See you again as soon as possible.